Well, I got my hired help, Mrs. P.I.B. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, my wife is cleaning up her mother's car. It's a 2001 Hyundai little car. And uh, she's vacuuming, the, vacuuming it out and going to clean the insides and stuff for her. And a little bit on the outside, it sits in the garage all the time. But in the meantime, I'm going to work on this 79, I'm sorry, 78. It's been a long day, guys. And I was telling my wife, I think I'm kind of losing it anyway. 78 Chevy C10 truck goes by the name of Billy James. So, I haven't started it, believe it or not, in several weeks. Because of weather and things such as that. And, uh. I guess I'll just say uh, life sometimes happens and you got to deal with it like everybody else does. Okay. Let's see how quick it starts up. Like I said, it's been several weeks. Good. I got a good battery connection. This thing should crank right up as soon as gas gets to the carburetor. Okay. Let it warm up for just a minute. I'm going to try not to get in my wife's way. I'm going to be doing... I've been reading the comments uh, on my videos on this truck where I, my wife and I rattle canned the whole truck. I was going to two-tone the truck just to refresh your memory, but we can't find a, a shade of red that there's enough shades of red in the store that we go to that will, uh, you know, do enough to paint the truck. So I decided just to paint it all white like it was when I got it. Let's see if I can get this out of here without hitting anything. Hopefully not. So... Uh, I think because I am spray painting, I might come down here out of the way. Let it run for just a minute. I'll see y'all in a Okay, I've been letting Billy James warm up for a little bit. Cut it off, and maybe you can hear me a little bit better. Whew. Okay, uh. Was I going to? Oh, my friend, GM1038. Uh, his name is Brian on YouTube. Check out his channel, GM1038. He went to the swap meet, him and his dad, Charlie, and uh, found a bunch of square body stuff that this fella was selling. And uh, I wound up getting the whole thing, the everything for the square body stuff, I mean. So this is my Kind of like my first time to see it, too. I'm assuming it's probably for maybe like 80s. I never had one of these before. I don't even know if this will work. Let me see. Here comes my plane. I always have a plane fly over whenever I'm doing a video, and he showed up just in time. Let's see what this would look like. I never have bought any of this kind of stuff. This, uh, what do you call it? Like billet stuff. But uh, I'm trying to see if the screw holes even line up. They do there, but I'm not sure about right there. But anyway, like I said, this is my first time to see it. And I don't even know if I'll ever put it on. We'll just see what happens. Sometimes things mysteriously work. Sometimes they don't. Anyway, it don't matter. Anyway, I got this. Let me shut this door without using this thing uh, I got some uh, oh this stuff right here cab I'm, I'm, a, I'm sorry rear rear window molding say that three times I'll talk like Elmer Fudd 
from Bugs Bunny a lot of times anyway, but it, that's that stuff right here. This is. Uh, well, yeah, it says right there. I didn't even see that. Like I said, this is kind of my first time to see it myself. These two pieces here are new. Uh, GM. No, I'm sorry. Well, it's it's four square body, but it's uh, as you can see, made in. Well, I don't know if you can or not. Made in Taiwan, but you know, wheel well molding uh, and and some used pieces. That's great. Used is good. I got some more of these mirrors. Of course, this would be the passenger side, and let's see, driver's side. Uh-huh. Trying to get all this stuff so you can kind of see what I'm doing here. Let's see, I don't know what this is. Heater core for uh heater core for AC truck. New. So made in Mexico, I see that. So I'll just take their word for it. I'm not gonna open up that tape that uh tape, but let's see what's in here. Well, I don't know. Why does this stuff look like it's never been opened? I don't understand it. Oh, maybe it's... Oh, I, I gotta keep this stuff together. That's the corners. Might have to get me a... That's the corners right here. For the molding. I don't know that I'll ever use it, but... I'm going to keep it right there just the same. Uh, what does this say this is? Anyway. Uh, sending unit. Oh, uh, 82 <laughs> square. 82 square body. A uh, sending unit. A uh, gas, gas sending unit. I'm not going to open that up either. Uh, got this stuff here. Of course, this don't pertain to this truck, but it's for the uh, headlight bezels for for a square headlight. You know, goes goes like that. Like I said, it's not for this truck. It's used, but if you didn't have one or whatever, I mean, it's better than nothing. I just bought the whole shebang. The guy Brian said that I was willing to buy the whole shebang for uh, you know what's the best price he could give me. And I thought it was a pretty good deal, so I just got it. Uh, let's see, I got a set of seat belts, blue, a set of blue seat belts. Uh, like, brother, yeah, I showed, I showed you the wheel well molding. Got a steering wheel with the horn button. It's dirty, nasty, but hey, I, I, like I said, my first time to see it, I don't see any gouges or anything. You know, it looks like maybe somebody just swapped it out. So, I don't know. Looks okay. Uh, this is the... I think this is for the grill. And hey, there's some more... There's some more headlight uh, trim, bezels. This is for the grill, I think. It goes up like this. I'm thinking that's what it is. But... So, all this stuff here is used, of course, and that's okay. I like used just fine. So, I can't get over that. That's pretty funny. I never thought about doing that. 82 square body. <laughs> anyway, uh, this is what I got. I feel like I lucked out and got a bunch of good parts that I will use sooner or later. Something else will roll into the driveway soon. And uh, a, lot, a lot of times, you know, if you can save money on shipping and buying stuff, and I always like used parts. You know, it kind of matches some of the junk or whatever I'm working on kind of matches. So, anyway, I just thought I'd share my good fortune with you and i'm real proud to have this stuff i want to thank gm 1038 my friend brian that, uh and his dad charlie for uh 
buying the stuff and of course I went I went ahead and paid them and looked out with this so and I I'm real proud for that boy a lot of yellow jackets around here new heater core 87 truck 350 AC half ton hmm anyway that might be handy to have maybe that's my sign I'm going to get a 87 who knows who knows what's going to roll in this driveway. But anyway, I appreciate y'all watching. And uh, if you enjoyed the video, give me a big old thumbs up. Leave me a comment. And uh, as I said in the truck and I was pulling it out, I've been reading the comments about maybe putting a little bit more patina on this truck. I know it's hard to see because the truck is white and it's blinding. And it's very dusty. But uh might put some more patina down through here just a little bit. And we'll see what it looks like. So if you're interested in that subscribe and uh, to the channel primer is best also if you have an old truck or an old car man these yellow jackets are everywhere and uh, they've already been after my wife a time or two already they get after me too if you have an old truck or an old car that you'd like for me to put on my youtube channel primer is best please send me a video with no music and no foul language and be sure be sure to tell, turn your phone this way not up and down Two or three minutes long to Primer is Best at Comcast.net or Facebook Messenger Primer is Best or Instagram Messenger Primer is Best. And I will be happy to put your car or truck on my YouTube channel. And the whole world can see it, your family can see it, you can see it anytime you want to, and you can look back on it a year or two later if you still have it and see how far it has come. And uh, it's pretty interesting. I think it is. And most people do. Most people really like, well, everybody I know of likes the uh, PIB subscriber rides. I also have a PIB swap and shop if you have an old truck or an old car or an old truck or car part that you're wanting to buy or sell. Uh, send it to me the same way. Primer is best at Comcast.net. And Instagram Messenger Primer is best. Facebook Messenger Primer is best. And, uh, you know, this, you know, if you're trying to sell your car or truck or you're trying to sell a bumper or whatever you got for sale or you're looking for something, please leave your name with a phone number so somebody that might have it might will contact you and uh, maybe, you know, we can help one another out that way. That's what we're supposed to be doing, guys. We're supposed to be helping each other out. And, uh, you know, you can send me a video that way, two or three minutes long. If it, if the videos have to be longer than that, cut the video off about three minutes and start another one, you know, and my wife can put them together and make one long video for you. And uh, I appreciate y'all watching this video, and I hope you enjoyed looking at some of the parts I got. And uh, I know I am. I'm pretty happy about it. So God bless y'all. Catch you in the next one. See you later. Hey guys, just because curiosity was killing me, I looked to see if this sending unit was new, and it is brand new in the box. Brand new in the box. And I forgot to tell you, also, that uh, along with all the stuff that I got, uh, I, I wound up getting a, I think it's a 1980 or 81 Chevrolet C10 uh, front bumper. So anyway, I'm trying to put all this stuff together so I won't lose it. I can't keep up with nothing. So I'm going to tape this up. And this is a uh, new thing. Well, yeah. When I seen this, I thought, well, that's 82. So that bumper, front bumper I got, which I don't have yet. It's still at uh, Brian's. Uh, I'll pick it up when I drive something. It's got a truck. But uh, anyway, most of this stuff, I believe, is from an 82 C10 square body so i just thought i'd mention that to you not that anybody's probably really concerned and uh as far as the seat belts goes i've looked in the looked in the box and uh i just got the ends like this and the one on the other side there it wasn't a full set of seat belts so i got the ends the the rest of the box had a water pump in it and uh it looked a little bit rusty, so I'm assuming it had been changed out. Probably still good, but I don't know. I'm the type of person, if I'm getting a water pump, I'll probably just get new. But, you know, 
maybe if you're out on a trip or something some of this stuff is not is not readily available in uh, auto parts anymore everything's got newer stuff in it so anyway I just thought I'd tell you that a little bit I just mainly because I can look back at them in the video and remember <laughs> just what I just what I do have oh yeah let's look at this let's see if this heater core is new I should have done this when I did the video earlier I got me some painters tape here so I'll tape it back up this is the heater core by golly it looks brand new too so really got lucky so I'll pick this back up and if I can't remember what I've got I can come back and look back on this so anyway I just thought I'd tell you because I'm because I'm a nut thanks for watching guys see you later